I've seen or here to, to see is the rank 313 reward. So if you hit max rank in Garden Warfare 1, you will unlock in Garden Warfare 2 the legendary unicorn chomper. Man! <laughs> That's Woo! right. It is as magical and amazing as it sounds. Uh, and we're going to give you a, look. a little look at that right now. I'm going to go in slowly just for the epic levels. The build. What's that over there? Actually, let me just move him a bit. Oh! Uh, <laughs> look at him! Oh my goodness! Look at how magical he is. Oh, this is your reward, guys. So this is a thank you to all of our fans for helping us build such an amazing game. The dev team have done an amazing job on Garden Warfare 2, and all the feedback in Garden Warfare 1 has led to this great, great game. And this is the chomper that you will get if you are 313. This is the only way to get this chomper in the game. If you're at 313, that is how you're going to get it. Look how Such cool Such a majestic this name. Let's make him run around a little bit. So oh, as you can see, it, it just it has a magical trail behind it. Um, it <laughs> and so it, what's, what's, what I think anyway is that it's based on, I don't have any conclusive evidence on this, but I believe it's based on uh, Bjorn from Peggle. It looks like of, that. Yeah, which is one of PopCap's um, A Ball and Peg Puzzle Adventure. <laughs> uh, Anyway, and so there's something cool to note about the Unicorn Chomper, in addition to how amazing it looks. Um, he also has a, a different kind of ability than any of the other Chompers. Now, it's, it, it's, and you can also, it's also important to know that you can switch, you can basically switch up how you want to use it. So you can change that ability if you want, it, if you want Burrow, because Burrow's, as you, know, as you might know, is, is the basic Chomper ability. You can go underground to, to then attack your foes. Uh, but but the Unicorn Chopper starts with a magical warp ability. So instead of burrowing, <laughs> he just I moved. Forward. I moved the character. That was me. So this is what it looks like. Whoa! It's a magical. It's a rainbow warp. Oh! Yeah. So if you ever need to close the gap on the, all your foes, which Chompers need to do frequently, then that is how you do it. That amazing, amazing. Warp ability. I wonder if I can show it outside of camera. Let me see if I can. Just so people can get a look. One more time. I've got no hood on, so I don't... Oh! Uh, <laughs> that just moved the camera loads. Too it looked, fast. It looked awesome. Too furious. So as you can see, you move pretty fast with this guy. He's super, super, super awesome. So the Rainbow Dash, you have a lot of hype around that. I mean, we're really happy with how it looked and how it came together. Um, big props to the dev team there. They've really gone the extra mile well. Pretty much across the board, but um, anyway, <laughs> we're gonna uh, we're gonna go ahead and get started here with uh, some gameplay now. Are we? Yeah, I think we should. <laughs> what do you guys think? Want to see some gameplay? So, what are we gonna show him? Um, well, we're gonna be jumping into um, showing off a new map called the Great White North. It is a uh, a gardens and graveyards map. And so, or excuse me, yes, Gardens Grey Arts, zombies attacking, plants defending. Um, it's, you know, as, as the name suggests, there's a lot of snow. It's, uh, it's a place where a Yeti could live, one might say. Oh, <laughs> um, interesting, Mr. Bomb. Yeah, so we're going to be playing that against AI. Uh, but in the meantime, I wanted to make sure you guys were aware that the EA Access Vault on Xbox One is open to all Xbox Live Gold subscribers right now. So that means all of EA's games that are in the vault there, including Garden Warfare 1, are available to play for free. Uh, what? Yes, for anyone who has a, a gold subscription, basically. Um, now, that that <laughs> the ability for everyone to play Garden Warfare 1, I mean, we, we wanted to provide that incentive right now so you guys can, uh, even if you, you don't own the game, you can get in there and, and you know, rank up and you can get these rewards in Garden Warfare 2. So, anyway, do that. Please go ahead and do that. Uh, try it out if you have a gold subscription um, and see how high you can get. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, fire up the build, shall we? Okay, so to do that, we're gonna have to stop the stream just briefly um, so we can show the gameplay. So I wanted uh, you guys to take a quick look at that football pitch because it's so epic looking. Um, and don't forget, you can play games of football with, well, soccer, I suppose, for the U.S. <laughs> audience. But football, for us English folk, um, you get to play that uh, as well. You saw that fireworks go off, your scoreboard works. It's pretty rad. And like we said, you, in the beta, it was such a limited look at backyard battleground compared to what there is 
Um, you know, again, we're not going to show you much today because we want you guys to discover it yourselves. So just a recap before we go into the, the gameplay, we're going to stop the stream in two seconds. We're going to stay in the chat so you can still chat to us while we bring this new map up. Um, it's important because we're, we're not actually in the PopCap office, so I have to connect from home. So it takes an extra second to do it. So just know that. Um, so if you guys can just bear with us for two seconds, we'll get that up and running. Do you want to stop it for one second, Adam?